Hi kids, welcome back to week three of Jesus Fixed It, where we've been learning about the miracles that Jesus did. Now, if you have something broken in your home, call it trading. Or if you're sick, you'll go and see a doctor. But once the situation is fixed, you no longer go and see the tradie or the doctor. They're no longer part of your life. But Jesus isn't like that. He doesn't just want to fix your problem. He wants to be a part of your life all the time. So this week, you're going to hear about a miracle that shows just that. Hi kids! Ready to hear about another one of Jesus' miracles? Yippee! Well, one day when Jesus was with his disciples, they were walking along and they came across a man who was blind from birth. Now the disciples thought that maybe he was blind because he did something wrong. Is that why the man was blind? Because he had sinned? No, not at all. Jesus told the disciples that the man was blind so that God's work might be displayed in him. And was it? Was God's work displayed in him? It certainly was. So Jesus healed the blind man? Yes, he sure did. But do you know how he did it? No, how did he do it? Well, he spat on the ground. Uh, okay. And then he made mud out of his saliva. Ew, that's a bit gross. My mum would never let me do that. And then Jesus took this mud saliva thing and he put it on the man's eyes. What? Well, that's even weirder. But it's okay. He let the man clean his face. Jesus told the man to go and wash the mud off in the pool of Siloam. Okay, then what happened? The man came back completely healed. Whoa. He could see. That is amazing. He washed the mud off and then he could see. Yep. Now some people found it hard to believe that the man had been healed and others didn't want to believe that Jesus had healed him. But the man shared his testimony and said, I was blind, but now I see. And then surely everyone believed him, right? Well, they couldn't deny that he had been healed, especially after his parents had confirmed that he was their son who was born blind. But the people who didn't want to believe in Jesus got upset with the man and threw him out. So Jesus came and found him and said, Do you believe in the Son of God? And what did he say? He said, Tell me who he is so that I may believe in him. And then Jesus said, you are talking to him. Wow, that is amazing. And the man believed that Jesus was the son of God. He worshipped him. So not only did he receive his sight, he also received Jesus as his Lord. Wow, what an incredible story. And for the man who was healed, the miracle didn't just end with him being able to see with his eyes. He was also able to see that Jesus was the Son of God, the promised Savior of the world, and he believed in him. He became a follower of Jesus, and he knew Jesus personally. Amazing! And kids, you can too. You don't have to wait for something to be fixed to talk to Jesus. You can talk to Jesus about anything and at any time. And now, we have a song for you. So kids, stand up. Get ready to dance and let's praise our God. <laughs> 